Hello, Amazon.com. This is The Matrix Fan coming back yet again for another video review. This time I'm going to be doing a let's show of the Jabra Cruiser 2 Bluetooth in-car speakerphone. I'm going to show you how easy it is to get this paired up to your wireless device, and then I'll show you the accessories that come with it. Hopefully from there you'll be able to make a better decision about if this is a product you want to buy. Uh, the first item that I'll show you is the little clip-on device itself. Got the little clip here that doubles as the antenna for the FM radio. Uh, basically on the side you've got the button for FM modulation and you've got the button here to power it up to either a computer or basically any USB device charger and the power button right here. All right, now we have to pair this up. When you first turn it on, the little Bluetooth device will be flashing there. So you hold down this part here for about five seconds, and I'm going to let you hear the instructions yourself. Pairing mode. Go to Bluetooth menu on your phone and search for devices. Select hands-free device. Enter PIN code 0000. All right, seems pretty self-explanatory. I have a LG Xenon phone here, and I'm going to Bluetooth, search new device, turn on Bluetooth yes. Now it's searching, and let's see. We found the Java Cruiser, so we'll enter the PIN code. Zero, 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 zero. Connecting. Connected. That's it. That's as easy as it is. Now from this point, I'm going to go to a little testimonial screen because I paired this up yesterday. I just wanted to show you how easy it is to do. And these are some of the testimonials that I got from friends and family that I called. All right, so that's pretty much it for the testimonials. One other item I wanted to show you on the phone is the ability for this to link up to your FM radio. Now, on the side here, you have a little button that says FM. When you push that, you'll see the little indicator light. 91.1 megahertz. And you just have to tune it to a station that has a lot of static. Now, if you hit volume down or volume up, you can change that to whatever station you want it to be. And then you turn it off here. All right. One of the other things I really like about this phone is its ability to play streaming media through the speaker here. Now, on my LG Xenon phone, I can play some websites like YouTube, but the sound isn't too big on it. Let's see what it sounds like through here. Sorry. Okay, well, next thing I'm going to show you all is how easy it is for this co to connect. Over here we got my regular phone, over here we got the hands-free device, and basically when you just press here, hold for two seconds. Say a command. Listen voicemail. Calling. Main menu. To listen to your messages, press 1. To send a message, press 2. To check receipt of a message, press 3. To change your personal options, press 4. To disconnect, press star. Call ended. So how about those little extras? Well, we get the charger cable that comes in the box. You just connect this into the speakerphone, and you can either connect the other side to a USB port charger, like a your computer, or you can hook this right in here and connect it to the charger station inside your vehicle. Now, the other things you get are as follows. You do get a little list of instructions that comes with the speakerphone goes through pretty much the standard stuff that I went through with you where the 
uh, different buttons are, how to turn it on, stuff like that. And there is also, I was happy to see, a one-year warranty, a little sticker that came with. So what do I think? I think this is an awesome device. I've used it several times. People don't even realize that I'm using a hands-free device when I'm talking on it. It's definitely safer for me when I'm on the road, so I don't have to pull my phone up to my ear when I'm driving. And I really like it. I hope you do, too. I give this happily 5 out of 5 without any hesitation. If you have any questions, please feel free to leave them down there in the comments section. And if you have um, any other questions you have, if you don't feel comfortable leaving there, you can always go over to my email address over here and send them to amazonmatrixfan at yahoo.com. Anyway, hope this helped. Good luck, and as always, happy shopping. And this is how easy it is to get started with this little device. Greetings, Professor Vulcan. I should reach DEFCON 1 and launch my missiles in 28 hours.